I don't know, Tommy, I would go between the posts, I think, <laughs> and then I would divide by four, and that's 46 and 5 eighths divided by four is something, no. Yeah, but I haven't got all day for you to measure, and that's the hard way to do it. So this happens a lot. You're building a porch, you've got a post, a post for a railing, and you want your balusters to be laid out evenly. Mm -hmm. How do you do it? My math is gonna be nothing but trouble. We're all gonna trip up on the math. Well, because you, you're measuring from the wrong place, okay? First of all, you also have to think about the thickness of the baluster, okay? Right. And so what I would do is I would go to the fabric store or the store and just get a, an elastic band. Really? Yeah. And what I've done is I put a little bit of tension on it, kept it in that position, and I just put four inch increments over the length of the elastic. So now if I pull that out, okay. it's gonna change that dimension. So, so next, as we pull this, that four inch increment gets a little bit bigger? Right, now the key is that you're gonna, you have to think of each post as a baluster. Okay. Okay? So now, this baluster here, and this baluster here, and you don't wanna measure in between the two. So I wanna measure, in this case, from the right side of this baluster, Right to the far, right, the side far of right side of this baluster. And if I take this elastic and I bring it over and I stop at this line right here, if you see the elastic, watch what happens when I stretch it, okay? All of those four inch increments will grow equally over the length of the elastic band. Doesn't code say that the opening can't be bigger than four inches? So if you start with a four inch hash mark and you stretch it, you're gonna be in trouble? but you're not allowing for the thickness of the baluster. I was just gonna say that. Yeah, so now if I take and I put it on the side, right there, and the side here, all the way down, there and here, okay? So now we are equally spaced in the center, but also at each post. So everything is equal from each other, and the end ones are both equal distance from the posts. Exactly. That's the key. This one has to be the same as the other, aesthetically. That's awesome. So how are you gonna get another one of these? Uh, I guess I'll have to go to the fabric store. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project. So be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button. Make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.